Hello, my name is Kerwin, and in this video I'm going to be showing my Delta 18900L drill press. Uh, in this video I'm going to show uh, an unboxing and installation, um, and I do this all by myself. Uh, I also show uh, quickly how I make a mobile base. So I'll test the uh, run out, uh, as well as uh, just try it out real fast, drilling a piece of wood with a Forstner bit. So if you're thinking about getting one of these, you might find uh, this video uh, of interest. Thanks, and let's get started. Probably what I'll end up doing is um, opening up and taking some pieces out to lighten it a little bit and then I'll ease the box onto the floor. There's the manual. Alright, here is a something. Looks like Here's the table. That was worth it because this is this is probably like 50 pounds just by itself. Another thing I found is my friend Chuck. It's pretty substantial, pretty beefy. Pull out the mast and the base. And then it'll just be the head, so I think I can pretty easily get the, the box down on the floor. Mass uh, is pretty heavy. I'm going to start with the base. Yeah, not, not too bad. Okay, so now just the uh, the mast and the, uh, the head are inside of the box. And I'm going to try to just... Uh, See if I can pull out and drop it down onto the floor. Yeah, that was that was pretty easy. So I just got the back with one hand, so it's pretty doable. Obviously, if you got uh, you know you got some buddies available, uh, you know buy them some beer <laughs> and have them out. Yeah, I just didn't have anybody available today. And I was pretty sure I could handle it, and I, and I was.
speed change, so I will open up the top. One half inch and a hardwood. 260. 60. Just put that little weaver there. I'm gonna go about there. And this is pretty neat uh, feature for the depth stop. I can hit this nut. against the stop, so no problems. All right, so there you have it. Uh, to sum up, uh, I am very happy. Uh, for me, this drill press was uh, a big upgrade before I had a bench top. Uh, didn't have much of a capacity front to back. Um, it only had about a three inch uh, quill travel. Uh, and it was a bit underpowered and the wobble was, uh, was quite bad. I mean, it was, it was a cheap bench top drill press so uh, no surprise uh, for me this was a big big jump up with uh, this Delta I get uh, six inches of quill travel uh, which is a pretty big deal it's a lot more precise I never even measured the run out on my other one but it was I mean it was pretty bad uh, whereas here a 2.5 thousandths of an inch run out um, for me is quite precise if you're a machinist maybe that's not uh, good enough but for me it's pretty great um, and then the, uh, the feature that I really liked was the, uh, the table, the large size working table is, uh, is built in and it has some great features like uh, the ability to tilt and it's just a, 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 you know, a large size, easy to work on, has the T-track so that I can hold down my work uh, quite well. I also picked up the, uh, the Biesenmeyer fence, which is a great uh, thing to start with. Anyway, I'm happy and I definitely recommend it. Thanks for watching. Take care.